Hello, and welcome to UNLV. My name is Trisha, and I work with the academic advising community here on campus. As a new student, you will have a dedicated academic advisor who will help you understand the ins and outs of your degree program, while also providing must-know information about registration and plans that will help you reach your academic goals. Your academic advisor is excited to work with you as you embark on your college journey, and they will be here to support you as you pursue your dreams. This presentation will cover some information that will be important to understand as you prepare to attend new student orientation this summer. At orientation, your academic advisor will prepare your first semester schedule for you that you will receive on your NSO date. At UNLV, math and English are required during your first year, so your academic advisor will use your official placement scores that you submitted to admissions for enrollment into your math and English courses. With that said, I'll now cover some important information on placement into math and English. This slide shows the placement table for math at UNLV. If you've already taken the ACT or SAT, please be sure to reference your score on the placement chart to see what course you place into. For example, if you had an ACT score of 22, you would place into Math 120 or 124. Selecting which course will depend on your major, and this your advisor will help you with. Each major requires a different math course, so your academic advisor will help you identify which course you will need. As you can see from this chart, if you do not have an ACT score of 22 or an SAT score of 530, you would place into a five credit co-requisite math course. Students in this situation should utilize UNLV's free math placement assessment to confirm your math readiness. We know students may have taken the ACT or SAT exam a while ago, or they might have been under stress at the time of the exam, especially with all that is going on. So utilizing the UNLV placement option might help to secure a higher placement score, which could result in taking a three credit course instead of a five credit one. For math, our department applies a two-year expiration on ACT or SAT scores, so you would also need to pay attention to the date you took your exam in order to use the score for placement. If you have not taken the ACT or SAT, do not worry. We have options available for you that I will cover soon. With English, you will notice the same thing. Students with an ACT less than 18 or an SAT less than 480 would place into a five credit English course. Again, utilizing the free placement options that we have at UNLV helps students that might place into a five credit course take a three credit course instead. Now I'll cover some placement information. So for math, we utilize the Alex placement assessment. This is an online placement assessment that students can take from home. Assessment scores are valid for one year and this is free of cost to all students. The process for taking Alex placement is with ProctorU and is delivered through Web Campus. So students can activate their ACE account and then follow the steps on our Alex page to create their Alex account. This page is within pre-orientation and your NSO modules, so you will have plenty of opportunities to explore this in detail. For English, the English department has created a specific placement assessment that's also housed within Web Campus. The cost is free and students submit a reflective self-assessment letter online through Web Campus that will be evaluated by the English department. If you have already taken the ACT or SAT, you will need to submit official scores. Unofficial scores cannot be used for registration purposes. So submitting your official scores is critical and you need to do so ASAP if you have not done so already. You can submit them electronically from the testing agency using the code on this screen. You can email official score reports to ugdocuments at unlv.edu or you can mail score reports to the UNLV Office of Admissions. Scores are required to register for NSO 
and will be used as your academic advisor creates your first semester schedule. Your academic advisor can't wait to work with you this summer at New Student Orientation. We hope this information was helpful to you and please be sure to take action on your math and English placement as soon as possible. We'll see you at NSO.